McLaren's house has celebrated the start of the new school term by posting a throwback picture of the Prince of Wales as a student. The black and white image shows future King Charles cycling over a bridge while studying at Cambridge University in 1969. The prince once revealed how he was run over by a buses while cycling around the city during his university days. Charles, who studied at Trinity College between 1967 and 1970, recalled his near miss outside the university's Fitzwilliam Museum. The prince, who turned 70 in November, said of his time in education when he returned to visit the museum with the Duchess of Cornwall in 2016, all I can tell you is the time goes past unbelievably quickly. But I enjoyed it enormously. If you look at the results now, as far as I'm concerned, quite how I survived being run over by a bus when I was on a bicycle just outside here, I don't know. Dotty joked, but it was a very special experience. As most of you probably know. Charles began studying archaeology and physical and social anthropology at the university in 1967, but a year later switched to history and went on to graduate with a 2-2 in 1970. The 70-year-old royal was last seen on New Year's Day when he joined Nicola Sturgeon at a service marking 100 years since the Eel Air disaster, in which 201 sailors died on their way home from World War I. Charles spoke of the indescribable grief of the islanders after the tragedy, which Scotland's first minister Ms Sturgeon called a cruel twist of fate after the men had survived the war. The service marked Charles's first engagement of 2019 following his Christmas break which he spent with other members of the royal family at Sandringham. The prince joined his sons Harry and William and their wives Meghan and Kate at the Christmas Day service at St. Mary Magdalene Church, just a short walk from Sandringham House. His wife Camilla, the Duchess of Cornwall, however, was absent and was believed to be recovering from a heavy cold. 